So we're gonna be doing homemade chicken meatballs using fresh mints and fresh ingredients. Let's go. Lovely, wholesome, flavoursome, all the adjectives, it's good. So I have got my chicken mince in a bowl and I've gone for about 100 grams of chicken. Uh, that's all I had, but if you guys want to double the portion, you can. So to a bowl, I'm going to add some garlic cubes. Now you can get these from any shop. They're just really easy because it's pre-frozen garlic. Um, so I'm gonna put a cube of that in. And I'm going to do the same with ginger. So this just basically makes your life way easier preparing all that garlic and ginger from scratch, from fresh. So this is my go-to. So any shop, you can get this. And I'm going to add a cube. So I'm going to put this into the microwave until melted. So I've got my ginger and garlic, which I'm going to add to my chicken. And I've got some onion granules, which I'm going to be adding in here as well. So about two shakes. I've got some cut coriander, which I have chopped up and I'm gonna add in here as well. So about two pinches worth. And I'm going to zest. And then I'm going to put seeds out. I'm going to add the juice of half a lemon in as well. Perfect. And the last thing I'm going to add is some chili flakes. These are quite spicy so I'm going to just add a little bit. Just a little drop. Then we're going to add a pinch of salt and a pinch of pepper. So all your ingredients are in the bowl. And give it a good mix. And that's all mixed and we're gonna roll them out onto a pan to cook. And then to a pan on medium heat, I'm going to just add about a teaspoon of olive oil. I'm just gonna roll my meat into little balls and plates. So at this point your meatballs are all done, they look really really golden on the outside and lovely and tender on the inside. So at this point you could put this into a tomato sauce, you could add this to um, a bolognese, you could have this with just rice and salad, um, a pasta dish, whatever you feel. But I'm going to add this into something a bit different, just as a light snack. So I've got a ciabatta bread that I'm going to just cut in half. And to a bowl, I have added a teaspoon of butter, a teaspoon of coriander, um, and two crushed garlic cloves. And I've melted it in the microwave, and I'm gonna just add it onto my bread. So I've got my two pieces of garlic bread. And I made a very quick white sauce, which you will get the recipe from my lasagna recipe that I uploaded a few weeks ago. And you're just going to pour this. A little bit of mixed herbs on the top, and that is your garlic bread with your marinated chicken meatballs and your white sauce on top. Yummy! So guys, that was my chicken meatball garlic bread recipe. 
Uh, like I said, you guys can just take the meatball recipe and use that in your own dish, but I decided just to add a little bit extra. This is a really nice post-gym bulk workout meal. Um, it's just a nice comfort one for when it's a cold day like today. You can see outside. But I hope you guys enjoy that recipe as much as I did making it. The smells in this kitchen are just to die for right now. It is just, ugh, it's amazing. Please try this one out. Thank you guys so much for joining me today on my chicken meatball dish. Subscribe, click that bell notification and comment down below. Please leave a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. But until the next one.